Hello, how? What is up, guys? It's uh, Aloha Rises, and you know we are about a few hours away um, until New World actually um, releases. And you know, I, I probably you guys are you guys, and you know, for me myself, I'm uh, actually excited as well because you know it's a MMORPG, an exciting one that we've um, already experienced through closed beta and open beta, and you know, it's just a really chill game, very um appealing very nice looking game and you know the mechanics are really different pretty um exciting there's a lot of good things about it and you know we're just we're all excited but um anyways in this video in this new world video um we're gonna be talking about the leveling experience you know on new world um in general we already know there's a few things a few types of ways um to you know level up your character uh for example one of the uh, simplest ways is just doing the main quest to get a good amount of XP uh, and another way is um, you know the, the general community board there's a lot of side quests that you can uh, accept and you can just go roam around the, the road from around new road in general and find uh, find the locations and you know just kill mobs or just farm things or kill um, animals or just collecting and there's also there's also another way as well which is you know doing fashion missions they give a good amount of xp as well uh it's the same type of way um same type of way just like the community boards like a side quest but they also give you a lot of um points for the fashion store these types of uh yeah this type of you know currency for the fashion store uh yeah th these these are the few ways you can get xp in addition there's also one more thing that you can also do once you um hit above i think level 25 or level 20 i believe it's level 25 when you hit that uh level you're able to do the main quest to the point where you get an azeroth staff and then you can start you know farming a lot of xp from killing monsters at the corruption or the corrupted areas there would be these red markers on the map and you just go to that uh, vicinity area and you just um kill all the monsters that spawns and you'd use your azoth staff to just eliminate these corruptions you know these are a lot of ways to get xp but there's just one thing that i'm very curious about and one of those one of the ways to get xp is you know, you know xp farming from xp farming grounds different locations you know different sites different sites in the the uh mmorpg game um dungeons areas temples different places like different monsters at certain levels you know certain levels where you can farm these monsters and basically farm xp i haven't really seen a lot of people do these types of things xp farming in general i've seen a lot of people doing quests side quests um corruption uh farming the corrupted monster corrupted evil <laughs> you know that's the these are the most general ways that we've seen you know but at, at, the, at to this point um like looking doing these side quests and other quests you know, at the a point you probably might get you know fatigued and you know tired and might get very boring so i was just wondering maybe when um when the game comes out when it releases there probably might be places where you can farm monsters and gain xp at and you know, they give you a good amount of xp just like quests side quests main quests doing the faction boards doing the community boards we've been doing um been doing corrupted I mean, farming corrupted uh, I wanted to give out like different types of topics from new world and uh, these would be a really good uh, things or ideas to think of you know it's really I enjoy thinking of things like this um, this game is really nice and I love to make more content on new world because I've been enjoying this game ever since close beta I'm a close be close beta player and I've loved it ever since but anyways guys uh, the release is about to be soon I uh, hope you guys have an amazing journey and you know have fun. Don't stress it out. Don't rep, don't don't what do you call that? Do a speed run, man. You're gonna burn yourself out. I just hope there's a lot of content coming out because I love this game. It's gonna be really fun. And you know, I wanted to suggest this type of idea that maybe we can get XP farming grounds. You know, instead of doing these quests, we we switch it up a bit. You know, find places where we can farm um, solo. Oh, we just keep on farming you know farming levels be a good thing to look at if you look at the video right here i'm like farming these skeletons at the yeah, amaranth amaranth temple and 
it seemed very fun you know just like collecting all the mobs together and then you start destroying them and you know the xp wasn't that good that's probably why i wasn't like doing this as much i was just trying to level up my weapons but this could be a, a bonus this could be a new thing that they should add in all right guys this is what i was um talking about in this uh video so i hope you guys enjoyed the topic uh if you guys haven't subscribed and if you, and if you guys enjoyed the video go ahead and like it and subscribe just one one uh step away from that uh, see you guys on the next video and hope you guys have fun when the release comes out. Peace, love, and aloha.